Hello guys, welcome to another time out with me on the channel. My name is Alec Godwin and today <laughs> it's all about the new camera. Guess what it is? <laughs> If you're new here, I would love for you to subscribe to the channel because here we do, yeah, things like this, movies, short films, tech reviews. So basically, if you love to watch movies or learn how to make movies, then this is the channel for you. Hmm. Now today, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to start up. Now, before I let you go on with this video, I want to let you know that the 6K Pro has been a remarkable camera for me besides SDI and um, you know just a little bit of that professional package that is not completely there it is still a cinema camera and um, I was totally satisfied with it that camera the dynamic range 13 stops look I have never seen any other 13 stops that is that good honestly so when I heard of the broadcast camera I was tempted it's look it was it was like this is it you know that's all I need that's the I, that's the cherry on top for me it's just like the a7s3 turned into the fx6 I would rather go for an fx6 than an a7s3 I had to make a decision on the Ursa broadcast 6k or you know g2 with the 6k sensor i call it the ursa 6k pro i really really you know was sold on the ursa broadcast and the fact that it comes with the ef mount free of charge you could put it on and forget about the b um, b4 mount which is fantastic which you might need at some point in time you don't have to start to budget towards it so you wouldn't be wrong to think in that line so you won't blame me if I thought in that line, you know. But here's another thought that came to me. <laughs> if I do go for the Ursa broadcast, how long, knowing myself, like, you know, how long would I, if I get some free change down the road, wouldn't I want another camera? Would you want to settle for that? I mean, the answer could have... I mean, the answer was yes, actually. You know? I mean, I felt that that was a camera to just call it a day with. With the package in the problem be Netflix approved. My bad, the previous uh, broadcast wasn't Netflix approved. For me, any day, it's a better camera than the FS6. For me. Okay. So um it won't be wrong to think in that line but here's the thing would i settle for that like if that was going to be my last camera which i really want to you know wrap up right now um would i want it would i so i said why, why not go with the best dynamic range which is the g2 4.6k you know so i looked at it 15 stops of dynamic range you know awesome camera records in progress and um raw got good frame rates <laughs> great frame rates when you do those camera comparisons you can you can hardly tell you know barely tell what the difference is you know so um i know the camera is good enough um the Cisco is good enough if you know what you're doing and uh I just thought that the Ursa broadcast um, G2 was just the ID camera, you know, may have an edge for me because I always want that resolution advantage over the six point um, four point six. But the dynamic range of that camera is untouchable. It's like, hmm, what do I do? Then there's the twelve K which is way high there, way up there, but the price came down and now it's the same price with the G2 uh, 4.6K. Hmm. 
here we have 14 in between 13 and 15 and um, with a resolution that is twice two times the 6k pro 12k man you wouldn't be wrong with, with any of these cameras <laughs> but i'll let you go over to the video now and 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 that's the camera by the way if it's not clear okay i'll help you out Ooh. Ooh. you see it oh man all right i'll let you find out so let's go back to the other video now i've always believed that what you say matters a lot what you believe matters a lot what you confess makes way for you or you know, shots away for you, whatever. Watching that live presentation from Black Magic Design, I was blown away. It, it, something had to be right. This is my generation. This is our time. This is, I think we have no excuses. From what I found out, most directors never even get to own their own cameras. They keep renting and renting and renting. And this is understandable. Sometimes they, you know, for different films, they use different camera depending on what they want to achieve. So why they might use the red today, they, they want to use the an Alexa tomorrow. They are ready to be flexible and that's, that's good, that's understandable. But there's the baseline. If you plan to shoot a lot of movies, if directing and movie production is your thing, you want to have one, you know. I'm one of those that, you know, I've never said it ever before, but I've always had a feeling that I will have my Alexa Mini. I will buy almost anything I need on set, I will probably own, you know. I know this will scare the hell out of my wife, but that's who I am. That's, you know, I don't struggle with it. I, I just have it in my head. But here comes a relief that I won't have to pay all that amount, amount of money to get a 12K camera right now in today's world. I mean, I'm glad, I'm excited, I'm inspired that, you know, filmmaking is gonna be a lot e cheaper for us, for this generation. I don't know how I'll get it. I don't know how soon. I don't know, I'm not like, I'm not like all pre-ordering right now. Like if it's available, oh, I'm not telling you that I have pre-ordered or I'm gonna be ordering right now. I want to be, I wish to be, and I'm going to get it. But I'm saying is, I'm going to get it first. I'm not thinking about, oh, what's in my account? No, I'm going to get it, and I will get it. Now, ladies and gentlemen, the awesome Mini Pro 12K. It is happening. All right, thank you guys for watching. Um, as usual, like, subscribe, and watch out for the videos. It's coming. Ooh, don't forget, we are almost at 3,000 subscribers. Oh, yeah. And I said, when we give the three gifts away, 3,000, uh, three giveaways, I will talk on the day I give those three items away. We're going to start talking about, we're going to start the promotions on that Sunday for the next giveaways, which is like the biggest giveaway I've ever seen on YouTube. If you don't trust me, we'll find out. So watch out, watch out, subscribe. Even if you don't win now, you automatically, when you're subscribed, automatically, you are in for the next one. And that's the biggest, trust me. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.